Hello. <laughs> this feels so strange. So, yeah, hello. I'm here. <laughs> and uh, this might be a long video, this might be a short video. It just feels so strange. So, I haven't uploaded for like a month. I haven't put up any videos in July and today it's the 26th. Yeah. And some things has happened and first of like the obvious one, I have cut off my hair again. As you can see, it's pretty short. I cut it off today. I just want to like wash it again and style it my own way, but today it have to look like this. <laughs> yeah, maybe I should just do my makeup and talk about things that has happened. This is like the worst thing with waiting. But I also want to talk about, I have bought some makeup, kind of much makeup, and I'm going to use some of the products today. I don't know what was the last thing I showed you that I bought. I think it was the new eyeshadow palettes from Nabla and also a blush from Nabla. I have bought another blush, I bought a Fenty blush, a cream blush. This is the Strawberry Drip. It looks like this. I've used it three times, I think, or two times. No, I think it's three times. I like it, but I'm trying to like get the feel of it, so I think I will use it today as well. I have also bought some new lip things. I bought LH Cosmetics new Infinity lip gloss, and then I bought a plumping lip gloss from a shiny liquid lipstick from Buxom. And this is the first thing I test from Buxom. This was on like super sale, and I just wanted to try it. And I bought a blotting powder from LH Cosmetics. It's kind of new as well. And I have some eyeshadow palettes, and I have more on the way home to me. So, I'm going to do videos on all of these. I have the Lewis Cosmetics uh, Meet Me in the Underground. I'm so excited to play with this. I haven't done it. I have a Swedish brand. Uh, this is Gloss Gods, making it flawless. That is a collab palette with uh, Samira. She's a Swedish... I don't know if you should say influencer. But she's an Instagrammer. <laughs> And then I have uh, Teresa Stead and Lethal collab and also a little palette from Lethal, one of their six pans. And I actually think that I will use this today. I bought the Memento and it is the pinkish one, kind of pinkish. So I think I'm going to use this today. I don't think I need to do like a separate video because if I haven't said it and I haven't, this is going to be get ready with me. And I feel so out of, so out of focus. Maybe I should just start and we will see where this will end. So I am, once again, sorry for just disappearing. I did make a community post. I don't know if all of you saw it because maybe you did not, uh, not everybody get it in. You have to choose if you want to have a community post in your feed, your subscription feed on YouTube. And I just wrote like, nothing has happened, I'm just <laughs> not putting up videos, and not much has happened, like I am okay, it's, it's nothing like that, but it's still some things that I want to talk about. First, I can like go through some things that have happened in my life, if anybody of you want to know. I'm finally on, I never know what to call it. I don't know, is it vacation or is it summer leave or what is it? But I'm off work for three and a half weeks, finally. I'm just going to take some brushes. And that has been like, I have been so tired. I worked so, so much. Like the week, yeah, last week, so the week before I did go on vacation, I worked 50 hours and it was not fun. And not at all. 
so like my energy hasn't been there and it hasn't been there for a long time. Do you even want to know which shadows I'm using? I think I'm just going to do something with this. Yeah, so I have just been like too tired to to do anything. You know, you still have to have to have your normal life to go around, your household and everything. And I have been like focusing on that. But at the same time, I have been like too tired for everything. And I was like, okay, I'm not going to do any YouTube because I don't feel like it. Um, yeah, but things that has happened in my personal life this time I've been away, not that much. <laughs> we almost bought a house like two weeks ago, but it didn't feel like 100% right, so we didn't want to be, it was we and another person, couple, I don't know, family. It was bidding on the same house and we was like, okay, we don't want this house so much, so we just stopped bidding. Um, it was nothing wrong with the house, but it's like, we had to fix some things, it wasn't like, we have never have like a fault to live in that neighborhood. It's nothing wrong with the neighborhood, it was like more on the countryside, not on the countryside, but now we live in the city, <laughs> kind of in the city, and it was like 20 minutes from the city, but we, it didn't feel right, so it didn't get there. And also, I bought a new phone. <laughs> I bought a Samsung Galaxy S20 FE, and it's pretty much bigger than my last phone, but my phone was like... It was giving up um, like I don't know I think it's called I don't know if it's called sim card maybe you know the card you put in to be able to do phone calls um, my old phone lost connection with that sometimes and it was so so slow and it was like I could delete like 100 pictures it still was full, so my boyfriend like, it's time to buy a new phone. So now in July, I celebrated, or okay, I don't know if it's celebrating, but I've been at my work for 10 years. It's quite a long time and I feel, one part of me feels old, but like I was 22 when I started, so yeah. So I got half a salary extra. Um, so then I was like, okay, I'm going to buy a phone. And I have never been, I have never bought the newest phone, and this is not the newest phone. I think it's like, they have three phones after this one. But like, I was like, okay, I'm going to buy a little bit a newer phone, and I usually do because I don't do it because I don't think it's fun money to spend. But so far I had it for like a week, and so far I like it. It's just that women's jeans and pockets, they are so freaking small. This phone does not fit in my pockets, on my jeans. But yeah, that's like the only problem. So yeah, we got a new, fo a a new phone and like the camera. It's so much better than my old one. So that is maybe the fun things that has happened. Maybe it wasn't fun that we didn't buy a house, but it didn't feel like 100%. So, yeah. And other than that, I don't know. It has been a lot of work. A lot on work. And my energy level has been so low like extremely low and also is there anything more like easy going i want to talk about i don't think so now the phone is making like to put off all the what is it even called
like notifications. I, I haven't done that yet, so like it notifies me on everything. I can turn off, turn off the sound instead. Sorry. And I have actually not been feeling so bad with not putting up a video and film, and that feels actually really good. I missed it though. But okay, I'm going to go throw this thing that I've been thinking about. Let's do it. I'm going to try to... Like, you have to bear with me a little bit. I haven't, like, spoken English for a month. <laughs> Just a little at work, but not this much for, like, a month. So, month. So I'm sorry if I'm rambling a little bit. But okay. I have talked about that I have been feeling low with motivation and it has gotten like worse and it feels like my creativity has been so... Okay, I don't know how to say this so it doesn't sound worse than it is, but I have felt like okay i need to do something fun you want a fun look you don't want like a normal brown look you want something fun you want like a cut crease and i know that you that watch me are like the best people ever and you don't care if i do a boring look but like for me it feels boring and i'm like nobody wants to watch this and that has been really hard and i've been struggling with that and I've talked a little bit about this before that I want to like find the joy to play with makeup again and now I really start need to start to do the makeup and it's gotten so much worse <laughs> and sometimes when I've done looks I'm like okay this was such a boring look nobody wants to watch this even though I guess that like I don't do tutorial videos so I guess that nobody's going to my channel to like get a tutorial because that's not what I do but that is how I have been feeling and like in my mind it has been like okay you just want to watch me for a fun look you don't want to watch me because it's me even though I know that you want to do that because you have told me that but I think like with everything I have been feeling kind of down the latest month and also like I've just like counted the days for my vacation from work and it has been much at work. I've been stressed when I come home. I have been in such a bad mood and then yeah, I don't know. I have just been feeling like who the hell want to watch me? I do boring looks. I am a boring person. And I'm not saying this because I want you to tell me otherwise. It's just I want to share with you how I have been feeling and so on. And I know deep down, I think I know that's not the case. But you know when you're having bad day after bad day? You start to think that things are in a certain way that they are not. It's nothing has like happened to make me think like that. I think it just have been because I've been tired and like out of energy and then I'm like nothing is good enough. And I'm try I want to do YouTube because it's fun. But when I have had these feelings, it has like been, it's not fun to do YouTube. And now I actually have been like, okay, then I'm not doing it. I have done my makeup maybe four or five times um, outside of YouTube when I haven't been filming now in July. And it's fun sometimes, sometimes it's not. And yeah, I still drink Pepsi Max like a crazy person. That has also been a struggle. But I know that you that watch me are the best and I I know that people come here to, 
to look at the tutorial. I guess I'm more like inspire you maybe to do a look or that you just want to hear me talk about everything and nothing. But I think it have been good for me not to just film then. Even though now it feels so hard, like I don't know what to say. I don't know what to talk about, I don't know what to do. It's like, can I put on makeup, speak English and try to film a video at the same time? Maybe, maybe not. We'll see. If you see this video, you know I did go through with it. Maybe I try to edit this and like, okay, this is shit. I don't know. We just have to wait and see. But maybe I can... I want to start filming again. I want to start to play with makeup again. But the energy hasn't been there. It's easy as that. I haven't been motivated enough. And I haven't been feeling like super well. But now I'm going to try to get back to it. And it actually was some days when I like I said to my boyfriend like maybe I should just quit. Maybe she just don't do YouTube videos anymore. But I still like to do it when I have the energy for it. So here I am filming a YouTube video. And also now when I am off work, I am <laughs> finally going to meet my parents. I haven't met them for over a year. Uh, we do not live in the same city like at all. And uh, yeah, you know that my father has been sick. He is, it's on the right way, but like the doctor said it could take like half a year for him to be kind of normal again so yeah I haven't like, been able even if I would go up there to see them it wouldn't be sure that I could visit him because of everything because when he was sick he couldn't get vaccinated and uh, everything so yeah I'm finally going to meet my parents again and my brother and I think it's my, some of my friends still lives where I am from. Okay, I actually think I like this eye look. It feels so strange when you haven't worn like makeup for a while and put on makeup and it's like... Okay, so this is how I look. And oh, my back. And like the hair. I think I like it short, but I don't know if like... I, I know I cut it this short the last time in September or October and I was like okay this is too short and now I feel the exact same way but I know that I liked it after like a couple of days so hopefully I will do it but it was just like I only did put up in a ponytail and I don't want it. I want to have like a I want to be able to do something with my hair and I want to do something I have filmed for so long. I'm so sorry. Like the only thing with the house that we did bid on, if we would have bought it, I would have gotten like an own room with makeup and clothes. It was like a little walk-in closet to that room. So I could have my shoes and my clothes and my makeup table and have like a studio and I would really, really, really want that, but now it didn't happen and I don't feel sad about it. So I think that is also like an indicator that it wasn't the completely right thing for us. And I'm sorry if I'm looking down, but I'm a little bit out of balance, you might say. Now I look stupid, but I'm just going to put on some primer. I was like, is that called concealer? <laughs> no, it's called a primer. Jesus. Have I forgotten everything? Oh, that was maybe a little bit too much. Hi, Ines. Yeah. And with the cats, I think I mentioned that Ines, that I took Ines to the vet. 
but I can't remember if I talked about why but she was like really had like mucus <laughs> snot in her nose and was breathing like not heavy breathing but like she had maybe mucus like something was in the way in the nose so we did go to the vet with with her but they checked her lungs and her heart and everything was fine and the vet said as long as she doesn't necessarily like is affected by it and as long as she is normal I don't think something is wrong with her the only thing that she could think of because she did take some tests as well and we did get some medication like painkillers because we had to rinse her nose <laughs> with salt water salt water solution sterile solution salt water lösning it's called in Sweden and we had to do that for a couple of weeks and take like a nasal spray for kids and it was so much better and now we do it like once a week and the vet think it could have been that she had an infection when she was younger that wasn't like noticeable because cats they have it sometimes but that is has like irritated her nose and now it's like a chronic thing and the airways swell up in the nose but geez he's like normal <laughs> he's so when we have rinsed her nose she has been so 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 good and uh, <laughs> Astrid she's still the crazy one as normal and yeah but everything is good with the cats it's just have been kind of hot in Sweden and they have long hair both of them and I have been trying or we have been trying to do it as cold as possible for them. Our apartment is really hot in the summer and we have tried but I don't know if you have cats. If you put a fan to them so it can like not straight on them but pretty close to them they don't want to be in a fan and we have put on like cold wet towels they do not want to lie on them and we have put out <laughs> so much water and uh, they just play with it I don't know, but yeah. other than that I think they are great I hope so because they don't tell me things And we were actually a little bit worried, like, if we would have gotten the house. But if we lost Astrid in the house, because if you didn't know, she's deaf. So she can't hear a single thing, and it was a two-story house. So, like, if we got home and we didn't find her, like, where the hell is she? We <laughs> live in a small apartment, so it e kind of easy to find her, but, like, in a house that is three times the size of this apartment he was going to lose her maybe she would have been gone for like days the times that i wore makeup when i haven't been filming i've only used this like glossier skin tint i really like it now i did put on the nyx tinted skin wheel that bear with me and I really like this one. I like the glossier one when I'm just having a minimal makeup. Like we were yesterday at some friends eating dinner and then I had it on. But I didn't have any eye makeup. Do you even care? No, I don't think so. I hope that I'm not bore you <laughs> with this video. But it's like as normal when I do uh, get rid with me now. I don't know what to talk about anymore. I really hope now when I'm on vacation or when I'm off work that I can try to come back to 
have like a schedule. I really want that, but I haven't got the best like way for me to do it. And also when it has been so freaking hot in Sweden. I don't know if you know this, but having studio lights on is pretty hot. And I actually bought a little ring light as well, so I don't know how the lighting is. But if we put off the ring light... Do you see how dark it is? Have I have I filmed with this dark before? I don't know. And this little ring light, you can take like different... Oh, God. <laughs> different settings. So... I don't know, maybe I have to change the settings with the camera for the ring light, but for for today, you just have to bear with me. And also, I really don't know what I want to do for kind of videos now when I'm trying to come back. I want to do some first impressions, but that has also been like in the start when I started to feel a little bit uninspired. I didn't know what like what to film it feels like i want to do something new but don't want to do something completely new i still want to do makeup but i just want to find like my thing and i know that i'm trying to do like theme weeks to my thing but do you know what it takes a freaking long time to do them and uh, I'm just it takes a long time to do theme weeks and when I don't have any energy to do it or when I don't have any good like filming schedule it has been hard to do it so I think I just need to figure that out but I'm going to take it really really easy we will see how much videos it will come and also like all the videos that I like ideas to film has been me putting on makeup and working full time you don't always can do a video per film a video per day and I need some ideas that I can do like like after this video when I already have the makeup on but I haven't been that super thrilled or come up with ideas to do it so then it hasn't been in videos and then I also lost the motivation because of that and yada 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 okay I'm not going to use the Fenty blush I'm going to use Nabla Lola so I used the Ombra skin bronzing <laughs> the Lola blush and the ozone highlight like what I always use. I'm having a new brush actually. I don't know if this is a good blush brush. We will just have to wait and see. And it feels a little bit strange because the last look I did when I was just sitting down and put on makeup it also was a pink look. So is pink my new thing? I don't know. I don't think so. Okay, and I'm actually kind of hot. Whew. So I just need to drink a little bit of Pepsi. And yeah, a fun thing that I'm waiting on, that I hope will come soon, but I guess it will take a couple of weeks. I finally, again, got the hand of Annette and the Menagerie palette. If you didn't know, I did get it on launch day the first time, but then they had some problems with the, the international shipping. So they closed all the orders, but then we the, got the palette, but they couldn't ship it out. We were offered to order it again. I've also made some orders from Colourpop so from Colourpop I am waiting for two palettes I think it is Lush Life and Powerpuff 
palette. The Powerpuff palette I wasn't like that impressed by, but I did watch the Powerpuff Girls when I was a girl. <laughs> so I wanted it even though it wasn't maybe what I wanted it to be, but I want the palette. So that I'm waiting on. I think that is the only things that I'm waiting on. And I'm so looking forward to get the net palette. Okay, I'm going to not do that much to my eyebrows. I just want to put on my my things. Um, my eyebrow gel. And no, this is not my natural brows. I did color them and I have some color in them. Like some brow powder I... I was to the hairdresser this morning. They just wanted to have something a little in them. But I did color my brows yesterday. I was like, okay, now in the summer I just don't always want to fix them. Okay, I'm just going to pop something in my wash line and put on mascara. And then I'm coming back to you and I will end this super long video. Okay, so this is the finished look for my lips. I used the posture from Lethal. And then I took this LH Cosmetics Infinite Lip Gloss, Lip Gloss Mellow Mauve over and... I really like this lip gloss. I used it earlier today. I bought it today and then I used it when we were out grocery shopping and I really like it. If you have been here, you know that lip glosses is not my favorite, but this feels it's not like sticky at all. And for the little palette that I have over here, I did put this shade in my inner corners. So I have used all the shades and I feel it's the normal lethal quality and uh, I think it's a cute little palette. It was the Memento. Memento. I guess that is the name of it. They released some of these and this was like the one that is more unique to my makeup collection. So yeah, this is the finished look. I really like how it turned out. I really like the dark here and then the shimmers and I did put this darker shimmer between the darker matte and the lighter shimmer and I really like that. Maybe that is a thing for me to start doing and I really like the Nabla skin products. I love them so that is not so strange. So yeah, I really like this look and I hope that you've liked this video. This is going to be pain in the ass to edit. And I just want you to not worry about me. I am fine. It's just that I... It feels like I've lost myself a little bit in my YouTube thingy. I, I know it might have been like this year. It has been shit after shit after shit. First I was sick in the beginning of the year. Then my dad got sick and an awful period. Just hated every bit of it. And then it was some trouble with illness, with the breathing, and I was like, no. And it took so long. I had the panini thing in December, January, in the beginning of the year. And it took me like five months before my energy was back to normal, but then everything happened with my dad and it was shit again, it has been much at work. So it hasn't been my year, if we say it like that, but I really, I'm starting to feel better and I really hope that the shit is over. I hope that I can somewhat be back to my normal self. So yeah, <laughs> that's all I can say about that. I really hope you liked this video and Please let me know if you want me to have like, or give me suggestions on like talk videos that I don't have to put makeup on to do. So not a first impression and not a theme week, but other videos where I just can sit down and talk. Because it, 
it's good for me if I can do two videos at the same time. Um, And I'm just going to end the video here. I really hope you liked it. Thank you for watching. And we will see when I put up my next video. Hopefully it will not take a month. We will see. You just have to bear with me. I I will try to figure this out. So yeah. I really hope you liked this video. And I am don't think I'm going to write down the inscription with products I used. Maybe I do it. I don't know. We will see. I really love to like this video and I hope that I will see you in the next one. Bye!